Hey guys, what the Bambi TV? Guys, we're gonna be reacting with Jessica. Guys, we're gonna be reacting to Muslim women leaders by Khalid Yassin. Guys, let's get straight into this. <laughs> What is the um, Islamic uh, system, what does it say about a woman being a head of a country or a, as a president? If, you see, a, a woman being the head of a country or a president, the Islamic position regarding that is that generally, generally, the role of men is to protect, generally to represent, to protect outwardly. Just like you have never in history heard of an army, uh, I mean a country, going to war against another country and they sent a female regiment. <laughs> it has never happened. And there's a reason for that. With all the liberation that's going on, America didn't send no female regiment. Because generally speaking, answering the lady's question, they are equal in front of God, but they are not the same. You see, if a little rat ran across here right now, the woman would be If it was a man, <laughs> it's right, Five. right or wrong? Five. It's psychological. Uh, when a woman sees a rat or a mouse, she's she, she just, uh, just get a different response. A man, he wants to shoot it or kill it. I'm so, going to tell every woman now. The creator who has made the human beings you know <laughs> the psychology of women. He understands the anatomy of women. He understands the physiology of women, the sensitivities of women. And so generally speaking, the, the creator has said to us that men should be the maintainers, the protectors of women and children. But now, if there are no such men to do that, then yes, women can lead. They must. And so it's unfortunate. If we find a Muslim country that don't have any capable men to lead, <laughs> it's not because women cannot lead. It's just like, for instance, it's better for me to go out and earn for the family and for my wife. Not that she's relegated for the home, but if my wife got to go out and earn and I got to go out and earn, that means we're going to have latchkey kids. So what happened to the family? And what has happened to the family in the Western world? McDonald's, Burger King, uh, 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 which was the other? Pizza Hut and uh, all those kind of places. They have destroyed the family because the family doesn't sit down anymore and have a meal together. They don't eat breakfast anymore. They don't eat dinner anymore. And there's no more extended family. It used to be the grandmother and the grandfather, the mother and the father and the children, the grandchildren sit all together, exchanging values, evaluating. What about the homework? What about this? What about that? Now, mom, she's out on her job. She's driving and she got her boss and her career and daddy, he over with his, his career and children got their career and Grandmother and granddaddy, they in an old age home. <laughs> so the whole idea in Islam is that someone has to protect the sanctity of the home and the family. Now we don't think that's the issue of just putting on an apron and being somewhere just in the kitchen cooking. Someone has to educate the children, maintain the values of the family, keep the time and take care of the home, make sure that everything that we're working for is taken care of. And the woman is able to do that. I'll tell you this here. I never really appreciated my mother until I became at least 40 years old and I understood my mother. And I never really understood birth and what a woman has to go to until I saw four of my children born through cesarean section. I was there. So I understood the issue of a mother to a certain extent. And so what Islam says is that the challenge of a woman, the responsibility of a woman, the realm of a woman is to educate the future leaders of the world. And all prophets had mothers. And so this is what we say, that women have their stations and men have their stations, but generally the station of men is outward and the station of women is inwards, although that could be changed. 
guys, I would say this is the best video I have reacted from Kali DS. And I, it makes sense. Like, I love the fact that he actually like stated facts, like fact or truth. I still hundred percent of what he said is true. Like everything he said was him just stating facts. I believe that women should take care of the kids. I believe they do a better job than the men. Like it's obvious. Like you can give if you leave your husband taking care of the kid, like <laughs> it's going to be a disaster. Kind of crazy play, guys. Like you can say him using the kid to shoot dogs, but like I believe fathers like if we have the kid, we want them to have fun. But mothers actually keep them worse. Like you have to wait, you have to do this. But sometimes it can switch. But most times, is mother always like let's say the kid is with the father for like a day like the father is not to impress the kid but he's not going to be there for long like he most likely going to be in jail so i kind of understand what he said and it actually makes sense a lot so what do you think about this well um i don't know being in a housewife sometimes he gets really tired nah he, he's not really saying no i i know he's not saying housewife but then so mm -hmm. Keta, imagine giving birth your children are still like, or your kid is still really small. Mm. You literally have to be with that kid, like all through, watch them do this. You are basically a housewife for the meantime. So that kid is able to like tell the difference between good and bad, or be able to stay with someone. The kid will be with yeah. start school, bro. But either way, it's not bad. But then him saying, I feel like when everybody start working and you know that family bond, guys, I blame this on Gen Z. Like all women want to work, and I feel based on women wanting to work, women wanting to work, kind of make make men lazy in a way. I will be honest. That's why it's not like Andrew Tate is always out there saying you have to work, you have to work hard, take care of your women at home, like. You need to do that. Like you need to be a man. Like you providing us what makes you a man. I'll be honest. But guys, tell me what you think about the video. Just like, subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time, guys. Peace.